Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of EverQuest 2, and I am here with Kevin. Hello everybody. And we are over in Tamora's Deep playing with our characters. Now I am playing a level 11 Fury, and Kevin is playing... A 13 Berserker, Ogre. And, and we both started at the exact same time, and I've mentioned this the last uh, couple episodes, but I want to just uh, let you guys know that we've been hunting from the very beginning together. We haven't We haven't done any experience apart, and he's two levels higher than me. And he also gets a, a bigger payday from each one of the quests than I do. So we're thinking, we're not positive on this one, but we're thinking that it's because he's evil and I'm a uh, neutral race. But it also could be the fact that uh, I'm playing a vampire and they may have a, a penalty for that specific race or that specific class that is known to happen in EverQuest 1. I don't know if they brought him over to EverQuest 2. Why would they penalize your cash, though? That's what we're, that's what we're thinking. Why would they, why would they give... You less cash for being a vampire. That uh, it seems more likely that because I'm evil and we're playing in an evil zone, that's why I'm getting better better rewards. Yeah, I agree. I mean, if they're if they're giving me less money, then I think it has something to do with a little bit more than than race. But uh, we're not quite sure. I just I just wanted to throw that out there. But if any of you guys know, please leave that down in the comments, and I'll pass it along to people. It is just something you need to be aware of when picking out your your class, especially if you're going to play with a friend. Now in our situation, this actually works out kind of good, because that means the tank is a little bit higher level than I am, which means we can take on creatures a lot higher level, because he can tank them. And as long as he can tank them, and I can heal him, uh, then we're perfectly fine. As long as he doesn't get too far out of my level range, and then I won't make any experience. But I think right now it's actually working in our favor, so. It, it might be just because vampires suck. Well, yeah, in more ways than one, I guess. But <laughs> Get it, guys? Vampires suck. They suck blood. Get it? <laughs> I think if they need to be explained on that one, they're probably not going to get it even regardless. But <laughs> uh, <laughs> So we're, we're going to go ahead and talk to this NPC right here in front of us. Now, he may look like, uh, I guess, a male because he kind of yeah, does. Yeah, he looks like a man. But this one right here in front of us and the one right here across... Uh, are both female characters, and the way we know that is they're voiced by female people, but I guess you could say that maybe that won't be the case. I mean, even if it's voiced by a female, maybe it's meant to be a very feminine male. Uh, there's really no way to tell looking at these NPCs, these these uh, these characters. They don't have any distinguishable marks, so if you know of a way to tell that apart, or if you know the lore behind why they look like that, that'd be interesting to know. Now, I could always look that up, but I always like finding out information from you guys. Yeah, leave it in the comments below, guys. Yeah. Yeah, it's it's always more inf uh, interesting when I find it out from you because you guys have some some uh, very very weird tales uh, when you guys share that stuff, and I love to share that with the audience. So uh, let us know and, and let us know how you know that because that's always uh, the most exciting part, I think. So let's go ahead and talk to this NBC and see what she has to say. Are they taken care of? Yes, they are. Nice work, but we're not done yet. We lost many soldiers in the initial attack, and more continue to fall on a regular basis. Tactically speaking, we are superior to the Wawarans, but no matter how many of them we kill, they just keep coming. Meanwhile, our numbers are dwindling. For your next task, you must go to the defenses we've set up northeast of Tholwyn Station and use this revitalizing tonic to rouse some of our fallen soldiers. All right. So it's reinforcements of a sort, level 9. You get 2 silver and 80 copper if you're me. Uh, chances are you get a lot more if you're Crusher over there. <laughs> this mission is critical. We need all the soldiers we can get. I understand, and I will not fail. Now, the voice acting in this game is actually really good, but don't get too used to it because this is one of the zones that they revamped uh, and actually made specifically for newbies, and it's one of the few zones that actually has voice acting in it. But it just goes to show you exactly how awesome that would be uh, when they finally integrate it into the whole game, if that's what they're going to do. I don't know if that's their... I would like to see them do that. Yeah, so would I. I would love to, to voice act one of these, to be honest. That would be freaking oh, yeah. awesome. Yeah, being... I, I would like to read books. I would like to read books for a living. Audible books. I would love that. I don't think I'd have the stamina to do that. That would be way too much reading. I'm, I'm an avid reader. I really enjoy it. I think you'd probably do pretty well at that. I mean, you might be able to... Oh, so it's these guys we have to click on. 
Did you figure out which ones it is? Uh-huh. I just have a hard time with the Scottish accent. Right. <laughs> that probably sounded awful. Better. I'm sorry, guys. Yeah, I think you need to work on that one just a little bit. Because that one, uh, yeah. But that's better than what I can do because I can't do accents at all. I used to be really good. I took... Uh, I was in drama like all throughout high school, and so I used to have a really good, really good British accent. But I had, I've never really been good at Scottish. I had drama all throughout high school, but I never took it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was. I, I loved drama, man. It was awesome. I loved the drama classes. They were very cool. Yeah, I was always in football or band. Probably most yeah, of the time. I both. was in football too, but I definitely, I definitely enjoyed drama as well. So yeah. I was a weird kid. And it, I think we all were. I mean, everybody's weird some way. <laughs> And if you're playing an MMO, chances are you're probably a little bit more weird than most. But en embrace it, man, because that, that's the nerd culture. Everybody loves that now. So let's go ahead and turn back into this NPC. That was actually a pretty quick quest. Yes, it was. Did you successfully revive the soldiers? Yes, I did successfully revive the soldiers. We should be able to so we ended up getting three silver numbers. and fifty-one copper. While we're doing that, it's oh no, really? <laughs> you actually made more than I did that time. No way, did I? I made I made three silver and forty-seven copper. Wow, the tables what are the turning, world? guys. <laughs> Maybe they mixed oh, it up. No. <laughs> I got his reward or something. I don't know. Maybe the first person to turn. Did you turn it in before I did? Uh, no, I turned it in after you did. I guess. Right, did you always, do you always turn in after I do, or do you normally turn in before? I think I turn it in usually after. No, I, I don't know. You're asking me too many hard questions. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just trying to narrow this down and try to figure out what it is, because if it is just, just like, okay, who turns it in? Let's try it again. Let's try it again on the next reward. Uh, I'll turn in after you. Because I think I do turn in, because you're, you're always talking to the... To myself over here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, to the, to the people who are watching. So. Right. Let's, let's try it again. Next time you, you turn in first, and I'll turn in second. We'll see if we'll do it again. So you heard it right here first, guys. Next time we're going to uh, try to narrow it down a little bit more. I mean, some of you guys watching may already know what the issue is, but, uh, you know, we're just trying to figure it out and have fun doing it. I mean, there's no downside, really, that I can see uh, to having uh, one player get a little bit more experience than the other. I mean, it's it's you don't want to rush through this game. This game is incredibly enjoyable, and it should be... Uh, you know, savor it at every step of the way because it goes by way too quick, to be honest. And, you know, you're going to be max level and you're not going to want to come back to these low level zones. And there's just so much involved here and so much to see. I mean, even all the stuff that we've been showing you, there's still tons of the zone that we, we bypass because there's nothing there as far as quest. And yet there's still monsters and parts of the island to explore and scenes to see. And that's kind of what EverQuest 1 was all about is that you got to just go off in your own direction there's like no quest leading you by the nose to where you need to go you just went off and explored and I, if i could just get you guys to do one thing it would be just to go off in mmos and just explore just check the corners uh you know that's where programmers hide easter eggs and i don't see nearly as as many easter eggs in games anymore uh simply because i don't see people really going off the beaten path too much uh in these games they kind of are led and in the direction and they don't really explore uh, a lot of the unforeseen places so yeah just just try to check that up if you uh, are interested in seeing a little bit more of the zone than most people will ever get to see you know take your time and have fun with it uh, if you do enjoy these videos though guys uh, please hit the like button subscribe definitely helps our channel grow and we greatly appreciate it also you're more than welcome to leave comments down below in fact we encourage it uh, I get back to you as soon as I can, usually within a day or two, and uh, we definitely enjoy uh, hearing back what you guys think. Also, uh, you know, we want to thank you for watching, and we definitely will catch you on the next episode uh, if you watch. Subscribe.